Hi, this is Ryan from Foxtech, and today I'm going to show you how to reset the control center on your iPhone running iOS 18. As you know, the control center in iOS 18 is highly customizable, which is great. But there might come a time when your control center gets cluttered or you simply want to return it to its original state. In this video, I'll show you how to do just that. Let's get right into it. Now, depending on when you're watching this video, the process may be a bit different. As of right now, the latest version is iOS 18.0. In this version, there isn't a specific option to reset just the control center, but that's about to change. In iOS 18.1, Apple is planning to add a dedicated reset option within the control center settings. So once iOS 18.1 is available, all you'll need to do is open settings, go to the control center section, and you'll see a new button that allows you to reset everything back to the default setup. But if you're still running iOS 18.0 or earlier and don't have that reset option yet, there's another way you can reset your control center. However, keep in mind that this method will reset more than just the control center. It will reset all of your settings. To do this, open Settings, go to General, scroll down to Transfer or Reset iPhone, and then tap Reset All Settings. This will reset your control center along with other settings like Wi-Fi, privacy preferences, and more. So be sure you're okay with that before moving forward. While it's not as convenient as having a dedicated reset button just for the control center, this method works if you need to start fresh. And once iOS 18.1 is out, resetting the control center will be much simpler and won't affect your other settings. That's how you can reset the control center in iOS 18. Thanks for watching. If this video helped you out, be sure to like and subscribe for more tips from Foxtech. See you later.